to the channel guys uh this this video i don't know if any of you guys ever had an experience working with this russell Olam never wet uh, i had this for a while i picked this up from dollar general for a dollar and actually uh, i was wondering uh would it still work on the gazebos like for the top that's why i would get y'all opinion for the top of these gazebos even though I'm going to buy a canvas or tar a tarp to cover both of them up. But still, I wonder if I use this stuff. As you can see, I had a condensers collecting on it. Um, so I was sharing with y'all, will it actually uh, work for the gazebo tops? So, I said I'll get y'all opinion about it. You know, see what y'all say. And if y'all had any experience working with it before, y'all need to let me know what y'all think. And how does it really work? Will it really seal in the top of my gazebos? Because uh, this thing is not all, all the way fully rainproof. Um, it's rainproof some, but not all the way. So, you know, that's what I want to share with y'all. No big deal. But, uh, yeah. Y'all comment below. If y'all think this stuff will work in the top of the gazebos. Or oh, I can just easily wrap it up with a turf or a tart, I might say. And be done with it. But, you know, in time. But they recommend for you to put these this on the tart as well. So, I don't know. They say you can put it on the tart too. Because it works for concrete, wood, metal. Also great for aluminum, galvanized metal, PVC, masonry, assault, vinyl siding, plastic, fiber, leather, canvas, and more. So canvas is like that tart stuff really, right? So you guys comment below what y'all think. And I'll hit you guys on the next video. I'm out. Peace.